Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. This video is about a wall painting I did, which I'm really proud of. This is my first time creating a painting so detailed in a wall or in a big surface, which I was really worried that I'm gonna mess it up. But somehow it was a great success and it looks very pretty now, as you can see here. This is a painting. So in this video, you're gonna see how I turned this picture into this painting in this wall and hope you guys will enjoy it and now let's get into the video taking down this wall and we're gonna be painting Hull's moving castle scene on this wall. This is my wall without anything. It looks very crappy and trash. I know. It's my crappy little mirror. So, apart from that, these are the total stuff. It's a lot. Now we're gonna stick masking tape. done now it looks nice yay this is what i'm going to paint on the wall it's like very pretty so i'll be using these to wipe out paint so <laughs> These are actually my, this is my pant, yeah, I didn't have shorts, so I cut my pant, and this is like a full hand t-shirt, so I cut it too, I don't like stuff like these, like, you know, so these are to wipe my paint off, and these is where I'm gonna be mixing my paint.
this is my little sketch on how it would be. I feel like I can extend the down part a little bit more. I think I'm going to be doing that. So I'll take out this one and I just put it here. As you can see, I moved it. Now it looks even more good. So yeah. I'm so excited to be painting this. Let's go. Try to get Tell me you were missing her You can't miss what you never had I said take a good look at her tonight You figure your heart out alright She's got a problem with your head But don't despair Cause she might come around But don't get your hopes up Cause she will let them down Completed the base And gave two quotes of the colors green and blue I mixed some Persian blue and black make this color now we're gonna paint mountains over there currently 3 20 p.m. the next day and I haven't started painting so I'm going to be painting now. It is gonna look very good soon after I add all the details. Brushes I'll be using. I'll be showing a step by step guide on how I did this here in this place so let's do it start by creating a gradient on top of this layer so to do that you would need light green greenery or this using white like this some dark green and some sap green you need all these colors and we're gonna do it here let's do it First you take a little greenery shade and mix it with the light green color. And then just tap it. And then you take some light green without mixing in it with greenery and tap it. Some sap green. 
and dark green. Just tap it like that. And now use greenery or whatever color you used beneath this color. You have to take this color. Okay. Do you take that color? You blend it. We will be adding some grass details. To do that, take a very old brush, something like this. Use a lighter color of the desired green you want. I'm using sap green, and then using the tip of the brush where the bristles were off, and create lines like that. This will give a grass-like effect for your painting. Now take a zero size brush and start creating grass using a darker shade of green. I'm using sap green first and develop the grass using the other colors such as light and dark green. Create a lighter green shade. I'm using the greenery with white and draw some grasses in the middle of the field. The pattern of the grasses in the field is your choice. It's all up to you guys. So be creative and go for it. Also use some dark green shades to make it look a little more realistic. Mix some pink, yellow, crimson red, violet and all vibrant colors of your choice and start tapping them on the painting for the flowers. For this painting, the main two colors used are yellow and pink shades. Also, don't forget to add white as flowers for the highlights. It's gonna be okay. the clouds and we're gonna do the little band over here some black and some dark green from here mix it together you wouldn't see any color difference but I'm just mixing it together and then draw an outline over here Take Persian blue, start outlining it. Do the rest of the place just like that.
heated it. This is how it looks right now. I'm going to be doing the mountains right now because it looked very tricky so I kept it for the last. I didn't know how to paint it but then my mom gave me an idea to paint by using the mixing tool and I feel like it turned out great than I expected. If I had painted it in a normal way, I feel like I would have messed it up. So it's a win-win, you know? Yay!